into the jet combo on the other side. NRG already aggressive. The wow. flash is out. The swing is there too, but second with the classic punches back. What can Demon One do? Trying to land onto a second. Nothing is found, but the damage has been done. And Doug, both duelists going two for O right now, evening things up for each other. I think there have been a, a lot of conversation right around second, and mm -hmm. we know the kid is nuts. He's goaded. He continues to impress and continue to improve. But I think there's been this question now. Now that the lights are at their brightest, now that the stage is at the biggest, how can he match up against Demon One? Yeah, so far so good. Exactly, and Demon One has been known to outshine every other duelist, and honestly, yeah. out out one v one any other duelist in this league so far. Mm -hmm. But Zekin, he's been putting his head down, putting the work in for years to get to this point. And it looks like this A site will be free. A little bit of a retake from NRG. And this is what we saw a lot the last time they played this map. 30 seconds left. Retake focus setups. Demon one sitting very healthy after those after that confrontation. Oh, Paranoia is not gonna land, but it's not gonna matter. Zekin with three on the round. All of them with the classic. And they get the spike down. Just Demon One and Crashy's left to try to save the situation. I like that proactivity from the Lexus sign. Is this? There's no way. Wait, is there a place that they can do this? They're all, it's gonna get really close! Oh no! Time to think it over. Okay. They've I'm invested. Forcing. Yeah, they've invested into the round, you're right. Stingers and then a share for Sasi. Once again, wanting to return to the scene of the crime, investing and turning their eyes over towards A. Marv close by though. It looked like they wanted to flood there, but something made Marv call that off. Yeah, I think oh, twice oh, about no. it. Planted. And speak of the devil, the demon is here. Already getting two on the round, pushing the pace and dashing forward. He already turned bomb. I mean, you've got to check it now, right? Surely you don't fall for that again. Demon one holding the line, or at least trying to. E3 Great start for the youngster, but oh. yeah, it's a rough start to this round. I remember what I was saying. Demon one's so good at isolating the opposing team's duelist every single time he plays a game. And he's so confident in taking that duel. And then, you know, some of the mind games become a factor too, right? It's not just the fight that's happening in the server, it's wow. what's happening outside of it. What's happening between the ears of the players. And so far for Sentinels, this is a, a good start, all things considered. Look at how aggressive NRG has been playing some of these setups. Trying to take the fight into the, maybe not at the first barrier, but into those spots that Sentinels like to walk into. Right. The second line of defense. Mm -hmm. Marv has gone exploring. Yeah, and off all that commotion, he just pushed all the way through A, like you said. An opportunistic denial of space from the controller. He's just going to miss this timing, but I should give the info that they are working up mid here. Especially yeah, when this trip breaks. Yeah, and you start to see some of the pings on the minimap, too. Suspicious of where they might oh be. Last player standing. <laughs> they waited too long. They waited too long. Marv not able to clean up the third. The but with 42 HP, that quick... To maybe save utility on the first choke. Bolt used to clear out the site. NRG respectfully giving up all the space that they need to. That's live. an amazing gecko all dog. I mean, it just created so much space. They're gonna live to fight another day. Wingman should successfully get the spike down, and the crowd will turn <laughs> right on cue. And not only that, but he gets to pick up the ult yeah. again. Yeah. So Sasi gonna use this for NRG's retake. It's quiet across the border now. What's the cue for NRG to go? You see some of the smoke start to come out from they're the controller. They're contacting. All the way though? It's not with second and tens there. And again, Sasi still has his ult. Hasn't used it yet, but I... Out of set. He does have his ult online. Oh, he goes up lane. Is there anything? Oh, the knife. He should know. He's got it. anywhere. Yeah, there, it's, it's almost too big. There it is. That'll connect. Marvel's a sitting duck, had nowhere to go. Tried not to move. Ultimately, doesn't matter. Numbers advantage, still in favor of Sentinels. Is Marv and Ethan have both fallen? Ah, still. That's something they struggled with the last time they played on them. They have to respect that. Start to see some of the flashes come through with the nades. Roomba on the way out, Dizzy. Oh, he got knifed. Now they have a paranoia. They're going to have to navigate around as well. Starting wow. to make their way forward. Second on the first, the flash, there's the blades, but they're no longer around for this world. Sentinels finding everything they could possibly want. 
and another situation where As they should but maybe that omen smoke was a giveaway that no one's pushed up no info on the other side the orb up for grabs oh one again just a little short oh he had a second chance he legged him clips him through the wall 25 hp for the initiator <laughs> But look at how much info energy he has here. They have him pinched. Yeah, I mean, they can't get out. They've lost all mid control. The only place they could really go is to spawn. And this hit has to be clean from Sen. Second has gotten out a little bit, but keep it close on wow. Ethan. He's tucked. And I don't think they know that Ethan's there. He finds two with the Sheriff. Crashes with another Saucy left alone. He's flashed. Four. Satcheling forward and continuing to push the pace. Look at how fast he takes control. That's of that. really close. Whoa, he got him anyway. This would be ridiculous. I know exactly. How does he get away with that? Massive numbers advantage for NRG. Oh. Still a 3v1. Zelsis with Spike and Toe. Two members of NRG on the other side. Where he just goes for that peak, lands the shot, and then also updrafts the actual Gecko ult. It's so crazy to watch this guy do these plays. I think Sen soon will realize that this is a retake setup on the A side. The trip was just high enough. Uh oh, he's gonna get too far up. Victor playing his position beautifully. Mark once again on the flank. Ethan's there to help, but they've got a trip keeping him at bay for now. No knife to bring it down or anything like that. They're gonna have to clear it. Maybe Mark jumps over it. Oh. oh, I like that. It's just a dog. I don't know that they're going to be expecting a second. Now they know the paranoia tagging onto John. What a great counter flash from Tens. Marv trying to keep them back. The spike ticking away. Meanwhile, a fight ensues on two fronts as the spike continues to get encroached upon. One Demon one's remaining. out, but now he's dead. Tens perhaps getting a little too curious. Sassy might as well. Nothing to clear it. Oh. Feels like a mistake. I don't know if Marv was looking tiles or, or what, but Dizzy wasn't cleared and Demon one pace for it with his life. So smart from Sun to pick up that Gecko Flash. Oh my gosh, but look at this. He saw him walking to be main. I think he did. But he didn't see if there's other people in there, so. Oh, he saw that he now. Saw him. Oh, he's gonna go hunting. Did the dog hit? It did. Celsus has no idea. There's no way he knows. Wow. So they've gotten the prize they were looking for. They managed to get to their prey, but the rest of the play is on the other side of the map. 30 seconds. And they still have the trips up from Victor. He has his ult online too. Second. What kind of post plant, Doug, is Sen gonna do here? I'd love if Zekin stays up there. They play a little high-low if you're Sentinels, but he drops down. Ends waiting with paranoia in hand for just the right moment to strike. There it is. They both go right through each other. Ethan got tagged in seconds. One who falls. Trying to continue to funnel out from the side as Victor plays his life, plays his time, waits for the right moment to strike. And it might all be too late. He's left alone. Creeping forward with three before him. One side of the map in the hands of someone else. He's just as formidable with it. Masking the his, presence. Is that his third ult of the half? <laughs> I think it is. It might be. Uh, yeah, I think it is. And Marv gets tagged. He should be safe for now. Oh, oh, Mike just misses. Yeah. Just a bit short. Looks like they're going to have to find a lineup for that now, too. <laughs> Victor's still playing on the site. He hasn't been cleared out. You wonder here what the flood is. Maybe off of the Dizzy. No Maybe off of the here. paranoia from Tens, but yeah, you're right. No smokes. Vic's still alive. He's a nuisance. He's got to be dealt with. He has to be cleared. Sean QT tries to and continues to push forward. 30 seconds left. But you haven't checked this box. What might be the most difficult one to clear because Crash is covering on the other side. Zelsis and John QT left alone, and it's all onto the leader now. 12 HP in the face of three. Oh, did he see him? No. No. Oh, but they know he's there now. Oh my gosh. Oh, and second just destroys him. They've invested the ult. They're going to head B. Crashies is here, though. And Ethan's not far off. 
and they've kind of been split up. I don't remember the last time I've seen a whiff like that from Demon One. Is he okay? <laughs> I would have lost my mind. Not with a knob, surely. Cover going out. We've seen crazier things. Sen playing a full post plant. Something I want to point out is that Tens has been holding on to his omen flash. And speaking of Tens, just takes Victor's head clean off. Three left up for the defense. As the timer continues to tick away, there's that paranoia. A tap from Ethan and the Molly at his feet didn't get it to half. They're going to have to win these gunfights because they know now that it's not being stuck. Ethan, halfway there, three quarters, 90%. He's going to stick it and he does. Yeah, yeah, and uh, and yeah, they were so solid, just like under set on those retakes, which I think is the name of the game for both these teams. Great eyes yelling from both sides. They're playing in the smokes, they're playing in the smokes. Dizzy over the top, the KO flash there too, and now they erupt. How much more can they find? Victor and Ethan keeping them at bay. In the face of the knife, they find another. Just when it looked like they were gonna find success everywhere across the map, Tens is there to counter. Just a bit. Is he gonna find more? Oh, spamming oh through God. the smoke, but they don't They're turn. So Mark is just on the other side. Ghost puts him away. Now John QT in a 1v3. All of them weak. All of them tagged. The smokes were fresh. And the timing's just so he doesn't see him. John QT with one. It's really taking their time. Look at this Viper wall for the B split. I, almost identical in concept to what they were doing on the other side, but this time they've run into tens. Ultimately meeting his death, but he's already gotten so much value. John trying to turn the flash to clip wrench dry and Demon's there to greet him. I don't think he's gonna pick this Phantom up. I think he's gonna stay on the Guardian. I mean, when you're that good with it. Yeah. I don't think he likes the Phantom very much, Doug. Great Molly. Yeah, they've just been a couple of threats. Ethan's tapped the spike twice, daring and beckoning any challenge from the opposition. Now Demon 1 hold the line. Second. Oh, the timing was perfect. Ethan in a 1v3 with the Guardian. Shadows traveling. This is, this is a crazy timing. Maybe a hard read from Sen. Understanding that Vic likes to throw this cam. Oh, the footstep was made. Yeah, he heard that. In and out. Will the mid players from NRG get first contact is the question. It just seems so far away. They no, it's out. Vic who's creeping Vixie's forward. Elbow. The contact Vixie's out. Vic sees his elbow, Doug. I don't know that he did. John QT toggling the camera, camera now, spotting Demon no, One. Cage triggered. And now they know something is afoot. Both of them spotted. They've got trips, they have oh cams. The paranoia is going to connect, but is there a punish? Is there something to capitalize on it? Yes. Everyone hiding. My leader invests the old butt. Crashies is done behind enemy lines. Oh. Can he find any more value? No. Getting in, getting his kill, then quickly taking a step back. Marvin crashes into 2v5 with 13 seconds left. The spike's one still not remaining. in a comfortable spot yeah, as it continues to dwindle away. Just one now. One round separating these two squads. What? The main fight is actually going to happen here in market. Tens is close. He has a paranoia. You imagine as soon as the trip goes down. They should be ready for this. Yeah, I think they're aware. Great knife. Oh, it's broken though. A better reaction. What are they trying to draw out of here? That's gonna oh, be a lot of info one, game for Marv, yeah. What do they do off of this though? And NRG are playing this so carefully. 30 seconds left. So quietly, so cautiously. Tens is ahead of the cage. Demon one pushing forward, Tens falls, Neural Theft used. Wow. Dude, they were down in numbers and they snatched this thing right back. Spike planted. Last huh. player Mark standing. was there to greet, saucy underwear. No real chance to fight back. I mean, what great mid-rounding with that, NRG. Without Viper, yeah. without the Lurk. Putting doubt in the minds of Sen. Off of that top mid smoke, yeah, they did have a cam that was holding that space the entire time, but the fact that they put so much pressure on that B area, John had to get off that cam. And that opened up the gap for Jimmy Marv to come all the way back around top mid and catch that timing off the B main contact. And a hold, yeah. And it, I, 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 just real quick, I gotta say, yeah, Tyson's been feeling himself the last couple of rounds, but I think that kind of got to his head here because for some reason he, he took a timing in front of those cages that 
That victory. Yeah, it is a little bit different. The angle is, isn't it? This is just to take all of sight. The flash. Taking a little bit of info. Oh! But tens again. He commits there. He did such a great job getting the one. If he would have just gotten out, had a 5v4 with Omen Flash, perhaps. Now they're going to have to deal with this pit. The one benefit, though, for Sentinels is that they have the Gecko ult. And that's a perfect thing to try to clear out something like this. Oh, this is perfect. We'll see if it can find oh. value. It's going to tag them. Do they flood, though? Do they capitalize in on this window as Mar pushes forward, expecting the aggression? The pit gets dropped. How much more can they find? They're trying to flash out and funnel through the utility. A 3v3, Jockey T, 1 HP as he falls. Elsis left alone, 16 HP in a 1v2. Wow. Up there. He has to try. Main. There's just a trip keeping him back. Mm -hmm. But Zekin finds the opener. Great response from Crashies. Fast. In those scenarios, just blast packs out. So yeah. again, like I just feel like Sen is making these small mistakes of staying in for too long. Sassy can get a lot here. If he tucks, the first is found. The second oh. does too. Omen flash right off of that. And the dizzy. Oh, this guy's. Yeah, he's. I mean, well, it's Demon One. <laughs> He gets his first. Isn't that funny? 10 seconds Ten left seconds though, a flash left. in his face, a spike in hand, but just no room allotted, no space found. They continue to swarm and pursue him. Contact plays, and here comes aggression here. A change of pace from NRG, but the knife initial reaction slows down the entire push. And the dizzy from the tarnish. Second was there on the swing. The timing is gorgeous. Woo. It's Marv, Ethan, and Victor are left alone. These are the dangerous rounds from NRG. That is true. They when, have two rifles, too. Yeah, when sound is cut and nothing is being shown, they just finesse their way. Look, they're, they're sitting behind the trip. They break it. Now what? What's the next reaction? That's Victor coming out. There's still one more on site. And John was here last time. And he's alone. And there's help maybe around the corner via Celsius. He's just now finally starting to arrive, but the leader's overwhelmed. Now weapons upgraded. All three of the members of NRG have rifles. They haven't committed to getting the spike down quite yet. Zelz is popping the old Ethan committing to the plant, and it looks like it's for me. Spike planted. They don't have any post plant utility. So patient on this retake. This son. But is the patience going to be their downfall? Is it going to be too much? Second with the first. Color me shocked. Second with the third on the round. Second as his ult. Off of the paranoia! Wow. He doesn't get it! All. Because of that Viper wall, Sassy can't give up the space and he's gone aggressive. He's ahead of it! Wow. And he's punished for it. Another one down. Crashies is playing this perfectly right now. Charges. Tens is in a really good spot though, but Crashies, you wonder if he's aware! Oh, the timing's so good! Tens continues to push forward, but with Amali at his feet, ultimately yeah. cannot persist. Spike planted. Celsus and John left alone. There is a challenge from behind the box as the wall goes up. Oh, this wall is so good. He gets out. I thought he was going to hit that shot. Celsus now flashed. Decayed. Paranoid. It's not planted for them, though. They still have so much time. There's nothing keeping him back. He's gotten it to half. Oh. That's all of it. He's been so aggressive with his TPs. Demon one already falling. I love what they tried doing there. There was a deep smoke into B main in the yeah, spawn and the TP to, perf to perhaps suggest that's where he was going. But Celsus's knife just denied all of that. He actually canceled the Omen all as well. Sendles with the numbers advantage. And they get the pit down. Crashy's getting healed up, but not to full. I mean, he still doesn't have it. Marv just tucked. Not, oh, no. not from here. Oh, every single shot misses. And Zekin doesn't. Sentinels just continue to push forward. Wait. Crashies and Vic left alone. The duo. Against the trio of Sentinels on the other side. It's fallen to one. The team so far has been immaculate. Oh, it's been a treat to watch. They've always, it seems like they always pick the right side. First trip cleared, the dog went all the way around the pillar. Tens does it again. Intense on OT. But can they counter? 
No! Tens with four! Things we love. That's vintage tens. What is this? Oh my gosh! It's like his bullets just have like a magnet on everybody's head. And that was Makes you think, maybe reading a little too much into it. Fix here. The cam's gonna feel a lot of the pressure. He's oh. gotta tuck tail and try to get away. But Deccan's gone hunting! Wow. Victor's there with two! Spike down A. The tandem falls, crumbles! At the feet of Victor and Demon One finds value no, with the up. What can they do to counter? Tens and Zelsis. Spike not in hand, position surrounded. This kill on Demon One would be Last everything. Player standing. Oh. Spike down A. As I say that, Crash, he's just one tap Celsius. Shadows traveling. But he's got two trips to play off of. They must know now. Oh. What's a foot? Tens waiting on the other side of the smoke. Oh, no. Victor drops him. John going exploring. Here. He had the moment, not clutch this time though. Flash deep into spawn. The spike committed. Oh, a spam kill. Did he hit the trip? May have. Ethan. Ethan Flash. He's got two, three flashes in his face. And now Zekin's there. Numbers in favor of Sentinels. Oh my gosh. But you, look at Marv. Marv just on the flank. The rewrap, Doug. But is it going to take too long? I mean, the onus here is on Sentinels. They have to take some space. They have to do something about it here. Oh, the gecko is Wingman got half. Wingman standing. gets you so close. But can Marv get a 1v3? He's going to have to finish it on his especially when they're on attack. Start to see some of the flashes out. Oh, Both of them through. And look at Marv. He's up top. Right where Thames was a few rounds ago. They managed to get the spike down though. Second has fallen. NRG with numbers. And there's no late flank, at least yet. Look at Sentinels. They're not wanting to play off site. I mean, they can't because of the Viper Wall. They have to play on site. Great Omen Flash. Buys a little bit of time. The dash is forward out onto their left. Tench trying to hold him back and he can't. It's all on to Celsus. A 1v2. Jumping up on top of the box, creeping forward. Timing. Demon 1. Huge. Celsus. Maybe a mid to A. Oh, it seems like they want to. Oh! I think he was a little behind the flash, just a little late. Trying to find a timing, maybe thinking that he had a hard read on the set up from sentinels in mid a bit of a gamble but you know what when you're in there when you're in the driver's seat like this you know sometimes you got to go for plays like that to try to win you know i think part of that goes to how they showed the, how they played around this wall in the previous ot yeah previously it was a threat maybe just banking on the fact that they might not believe oh, how does this guy just keep finding these timings how far up does he go by the way victor has been an absolute Freak on this B side of the map, walking into space. Yeah, he's been a proper menace. Gunfire erupts, his bodies fall on both sides. <laughs> this is this slow mid round again. But this that, that that peak right there will be the read. That this will be another one of those slow rounds where they end B. That knife tag both. Wow. Vic with a lot to do and he can't find any. That was huge. Sendles with the numbers advantage. Left. And the very likely possibility of another round of OT. Oh! Molly soaring over the sky. Marv getting spammed through the smoke. Ethan left alone. Decisive. It's the middle of the map. Sandals just looks like they're ready for this aggression, but I think Zekin made an audio cue when he got off this angle. The dash went out, but Marv stays. Wow. Does John Hart clear this? He has to look. He's looking he's right at him. The gun barrel's gonna give him away and he gets the kill. Because he's really far up. He's hearing everything. Does he try to peek ahead of the Roomba? No. Good Taking nade. a step back. It's a great nade. But somehow, honestly, Victor doesn't get away with as much damage as I would have expected. <laughs> there it is. The spike sunk into the soil of the site. Wow. Bobby at Vic's feet. Saucy's there to clear. This post plant utility is so clean. And Tens is on a late flank. Keep a close eye on the mini map. Can they hold them back? Second on the first. Demon one falling. One enemy remaining. And Tens. This setup could be disaster. There's four here. As soon as there's contact, there it is. Oh. Zekin gets ahead of it though. He's down. I think because of that, yeah, Tens is able to hold the flash. But there's a flank. Oh my Demon God. one behind enemy lines. Can I get two? 
Oh, Tyson tucked. He didn't show his gun. 16 HP. Spam on one side, the cam on the other. A 4v4. Saucy spamming into the smoke. Tag. Tanz does it again. Tanz in second once more, delivering for Sentinels. On the attack. Knife hitting back sight. And B is littered with Cypher utility. Oh, John Singh alive though. There's the trip. The dark too, but they're gonna get away unscathed. <laughs> it's the classic Sentinel's blueprint. Play retake on the Cypher side. And that's just gonna make for a chaotic attempt. Yeah. Add a retake, a 5v5. Crashies is taking a little bit of damage. Ethan has two. I like this from Crashies, but it looks like Saucy is aware. Those two are be this late B main flank. Yeah, those two are just gonna sit side by side while the rest of the fight ensues on B. They're all huddled up. It's so close, and there it is. It's a two for two. Finally, things starting to crumble, but Ethan trying to keep him back, trying to hold the line. Saucy from up top disposes of him. Ooh, they know it's just more, but the clip runs. Zekin still has the outlaw. There it is. Once again, besting Demon One. Good trade from Ethan, though. I love what I'm seeing out of Zekin though, man. That's a fast KO all. I don't even realize that Ethan had this online already. He still has that outlaw. They've got to know he's back there. There's no way he got out of the site, but he gets a second with it. Placing alarm bot. So it's a doable situation, albeit difficult. Yeah. And already very costly for NRG. And I think if I'm sent here, at some point, you gotta just make the play. Maybe we don't go for it. Maybe we just ruin the economy all together. Well, Zelsus did just get a weapon. Mm -hmm. Managed to pick up a Spectre. Oh, Spotting the first, oh, just a little ahead of the flash by the narrowest of margins. Now 10's feeling the heat. He should really just try to get as many as he can before he dies here. You also oh. gotta be careful here if you're Zekin not to overcommit. Yeah. Oh, not to over oh. deliver, but he doesn't make any noise. He doesn't get the kill. Oh, wow. Or warning shots. But is that going to be enough? Zekin might be in trouble. Yeah, he's dead. He had nowhere to go. The TP back B. Saucy waiting as aggression continues to trample forward. Marv's going to fall. The spam trying to connect onto another. And nothing's found. The site wide opens. Elsis and John have to try to take this back and attempt it a flood. It's denied. Crashy's weak. Quiet, his footsteps now pushing forward. Ethan disposing of the IGL on the opposite side. He woke up. And that's exactly what Demon 1 does, but the paranoia just waits for a little oh bit. Oh my gosh. He jumped into it. He jumped into it. They're trying to get something else with these pistols, but it's just so hard. It's so labor. It's one HP. HP. Oh! And he takes the fight anyway. <laughs> That's Demon that? One. What HP? That's what the one stands for, huh? <laughs> 30 seconds left. Things slow down just a little bit, but Ooh. energy have so much room. This is doable for Sun. 13 HP between Demon One and Victor. Two players at one HP. You have a Deagle on the board. Marv, one shot headshot to a ghost. This is very, very doable. And they might get spammed with this dart. When does he use it? Does Marv swing off this turret? Oh, so many options. Second guessing yourself. Oh, there's one! The second falls! Vic has 12 HP! Oh my gosh! But he does have a gun. Can he hold him back? The first falls! Victor once again trying to do it all on his own. Dancing around Jenny. Oh Saucy gosh. tapping. Time is short. He's playing with him. He's bought so much time. Oh the games already. That shock intended to clear the cam. It was there a couple of rounds ago. Yeah. Here. Should be a free B site here. Yeah. Demon one not finding any targets. Oh, what an interesting trip. But it'll delay and it'll buy some time. Second as an op, an Odin in the hands of Sasi. And another explosive attempt at a 5v5 retake. Yeah. On the cards. They're taking their time though. Wow. Demon one with one, that's all it is. 
Zalsus on the trade. Spike continuing to tick away, and Victor's in such a good spot. All he has to do is spam! Tens with a shorty! <laughs> but there's still so much to do. Oh, no, second whiff. And time is short. They've got to push forward if they want to take this thing back. Ethan and Vic left alone. Nice knowing you. 15 HP. Last there's there any challenge? Standing. He ultimately falls. Second is not yeah. going to be able to get... Zelsis has ult, but he's on the opposite side of the map. Here comes the blender. You're going to see Sova dart off of contact Standing with ahead. these trips and spam coming out. Thumbs There's in. a dart. It's only spotting oh. one, though. Nicely done, but the spam is there. They have to understand. Meanwhile, Zekin with the oh blades finding God. one from up top. Had to have gotten high ground, but Demon 1 pushing forward. Disposing of the opposition. Ult invested. 10 seconds left. They've got to go fast. But you've got to clear out John. Back sight. Oh! oh. Beautifully done. Doug, Doug was so clean. Getting that late lurk out of the oh, oh, What? What was that? We talked about him whiffing a few shots in the previous round. Not this time. That was cold. And he knew. I mean, you go back to the beginning of the round. The crosshair was expecting the jump spot. I mean. You should run. That was for anybody. That could have been. That could have been anybody from NRG there on the jump spot. They're yeah. dead. But who better for Sentinels than to take out Demon One, especially in a light by situation, a rifle in the hands of Victor. But that's it. Mm -hmm. He's gonna go re-exploring. If he gets a timing mid, he's gonna get both. Oh, and he hears him running up Cat too, so he will have the time. Oh, and Marv gets two. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be Vic to blow it up, but the classic from Marv is a difference maker for now. And this is the perfect bait. Oh, but Marv, or Victor whiffs. Time is so short. Oh, <laughs> time is so short. These battles are so What insane. a round. He's gonna keep the up. Oh my gosh. And again, silence covers the site. Mm -hmm. Just quiet. They love this door smoke. From NRG, they not do not one in the smoke. Yeah, not even a footstep. They're not worried about it. As the spike, oh, excuse me, the smoke goes down. The spike pushes forward. The flash and the dash. Tens is playing in wine, but that's it. John trying to find some value with the classic. That's a big ask. Oh, they they saw that, right? Start to see some spam come through. <laughs> as the defenses of Sentinels crumble once more. I'd be curious to see how energy plays this because there's plenty of time to hunt this op down if they wanted to. Chen, while they're hunting, you see on the map, everyone's moving right now. I want to point out that I think energy had a hard read into this round. I think they understood that Zekin was opping B because they made contact on Cat. Didn't get, didn't get any op shot baited out or anything like that towards that side of the map. So understanding that these bad guns will be on that A side and just taking their time, waiting for that smoke to go up door, not dying to anybody from sight. Tries to just show an arm there before he peeks out all the way. Yeah, dancing with death. There's a judge on the other no side. way! And just disposed of. That was such a good peek from Demon One. It was Going just, wide. It was effortless. It looked so easy. Looked like he knew. Peeked it perfectly. And here you go. You get the kill. You cut noise again with the smoke on door. I think this is all fake. Well, just for a second, it looked like. And it was just enough. There's only Zekin here, and he has to go huge for his team. He's got the op. At this point, you imagine you're just kind of playing to stay alive. Oh, he's got it. Kill the spikes on the other side, but he peeks ahead of it and tries to get a second. NRG is so smart right now. They're so dialed in. 70 HP, trying to dance around. Oh, wow. But he got the job done. Spike is planted. Now things slow down. A 2v2 as you hear the dart soar across the site. Ethan playing in a position to where he can impact things at the end of the round. Leaving Vic to his own devices. That ult's gonna be big. Can Vic keep him back by himself while Ethan starts to move forward? Drop Saucy. John by himself. <laughs> that one way is not kind. But honestly, I mean, tens of two HP. Yeah, flash, play. 
lulled into their death cell. So this with the right, oh, the right click on the flash. Thought he was gonna get ahead of things, but three members on the other side. And now energy can push forward. Look at the mini map. Just like you said, nobody on this A side. And look at how cautious energy is still being. Yeah. He's clearing everything out, still committing the utility. They don't want to get cheesed right now. Yeah, they're playing this round by the book. Man, this is so it's in the mid round. But without any mid control or any mid re-clear, Sen is just not, not able to hold these hits or, or anything. Right. So I think we need to see more proactivity from the side of Sentinels. But it just might be too late, Doug. We're too deep in the half. I mean, this is a 3-8, almost a 9-3. Does NRG give them? Oh, oh great. Crap, Molly, so though. dead. That is the proactivity we needed, though, and I'm glad it was off utility, making sure we don't get picked by the off. That's one down. And that was crazy that Saucy just went for the 1v1 with an Odin against an op. Because the op. He's picked it up, <laughs> and he falls. <laughs> Meeting the same fate. <laughs> I guess the counter to the op is the Odin. Oh. <laughs> it seems to be the case. It's a big kill, though. Yeah, but a 4v2? Maybe. The defense is spread out, though. Two and two. If they, if they actually group up here, it will be an even fight on either side. 30 seconds left. <laughs> Looking to see if you can find any info with the knife. No one playing backside. Yeah, Ethan's doing all this on purpose. Drawing Shadow attention, Shadow. trying to... Allow Marv to find an opening. That jiggle, I don't think it was seen. You start to see some of this pain come through. 10 oh. seconds left on the round. The thing is, is, they haven't shown anything towards the A side of the map. Oh, attack them. They're gonna push him. Second dashing forward, the paranoid trying to hit stairs. Second stair drops crashies. A window open <laughs> and Sentinels barge through. That was a sick night. I mean, he never was able to get the dart off. Here. That trip. Oh. So planted. impossible. He still has cam up to watch the cleared up by lock in. Oh, oh, the One flash down. was perfect. They've dealt with main. But the bigger issue lies on the site, lies before him. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, Demon One's pushing forward. He's uh -oh. managed to slip the net. Oh my God. You know, you mentioned just how important it was to win this pistol. Take a look at that oh again. A clean one tap. Ethan investing as he should. He's been popping Whoa. off all game. Uh oh. They know. Oh. How do they know? He still gets the kill. Wow. That was such a cool idea. Smoking off Vic so the dart doesn't tag him. Yeah. But they still had an idea. Saucy took a lot of damage there in that opening scuffle. Marv, first contact here. He's really far oh, up. Did he see him? No. But he Doesn't falls matter. anyway. That's a gun diff. That's now three HP. Three members left what? for NRG as Ethan continues to farm, continues to frag, and continues to frustrate the opposition. He almost hit that second shot. Yeah. Ethan and Crash, he's left alone. He's gonna find a time and gets another. Spike down. Fortunately. A. Disaster averted as Elsus cleans him up. But now Crashies is left alone. Planted. He's got full util. He's got plenty of health. Oh, looks ready. Just one jump. That's a footstep. Be the here. He's got to know. He oh. spotted a hand. Demon one shoots Demon just a little early. Yeah, he's stuck. This is very reminiscent to what we saw previously. Second gets him. Wow. Not able to dash away. Not able to find solace. Oh. Ooh. Ethan filth again. A 4v4, though, as the brakes are thrown on the round. Nowhere to run. Expecting aggression. Oh, and it lands! Ethan's done. That opens up the sight, Doug. Vic is trying to hold from spawn, though. Oh, no. And now he's smoked off. Crashies might go huge here. If he gets it. What? Did he just one tap him through the smoke? Yes! Shut down. And now Crashies finds success, too. They're going to snatch this thing back. Oh, no. Contends do it again. Planted. My ultimate is ready. Desperate need to pull out a miracle here. Vic is weak. The first one falls. The second pings on the map. Here. Oh, we'll yeah, the hit's gonna come through, but we've seen Marv here before, Doug. Second dashing forward. 
Blade's still in play. Oh, he's flash, tries to land the shot anyway. He's gone hunting, not able to connect on the right click. Mar falls though. Zekin with the Guardian now, able to upgrade a little bit. And he's trying to land the shots onto the op, and he does. Crashies and Vic left alone. It's all onto Victor now. It was decisive in the face of the rotations in the face left. of the fact that energy had a heavy presence here and the money is no. the question is will sentinels take a while they can he's got the op in hand ah, not gonna flash. find a timing window you're right destroyed. oh wait this would be huge he's very aggressive oh, oh he lands the shots on the saucy he, he needs to live now it's winnable doug demon one play it's online and look at crash he's in spot again He's so far back. I think he's gonna ult the back. I think so too. The only gap. There it is. Tapping on to Zelsis. Oh, just narrowly missing. And all repositions, but three players are detained. Demon one pushing forward, looking to find another and he does. That's the third. John T left alone. And once again, the seeds of a comeback fall upon a barren soil. Just when it seems like they have something that they could hang on to, something they could use to push back. My camera is destroyed. NRG pull out a miracle. And like, Sentinels was even left. ready for that. They, they had all the info. You had John set up, set up outside of B with the cam. Secure the round. Yeah. They close things out. There's that early aggression. You see the dart into tiles to flash up to try to challenge. Still guns on the side of Sentinels. There's still a chance here. There's still hope. So you see Sentinels poking and prodding, trying to find a fight. Demon One's on the other side. He gets the best. Uh oh. Of Zekin, but can Sentinels punch back? They're gonna get the sight. Zelsis has ult. Does he invest the ult here? I think so. Just trying to get damage. Get more ult orbs up. Contact again with the KO off. They've got to go fast here. KJ's on the other side, so they're still going to be able to pop these mollies. Holy oh, smokes. Hit. They wait out the mollies. They take the space. Where's the challenge? Where's the re-aggress? Oh, my gosh. They try to hold back side on their own. Crash, he's falling. Oh, my gosh. Or at least staying alive for now. Flash in his face. He tries to turn it. Zelsa sucker punches him. Oh. Demon 1 and Ethan left alone, but they've gotten it down to two. Spike's still not planted. Can they find the space? Time now becomes a factor. Tag them up. Just barely. Cover going out. The two implants, the two new additions to this squad with an opportunity to take us to split. Oh, that dagger. If they can drop both. tens and Zelsis right now. One Ethan creeping forward. Remaining. The first one falls. Zelsis having to clutch and he cannot. Split on the cards is worth. We will see you guys in just a few moments. We'll be right back. On this roll, and already a fast A default here. All five members. Dude, the omen flash, the sky flash, and the kill for tens. He just gets spam. He just gets a spam kill through the smoke with a classic. That's so dangerous to do. And there's a gap in the A main wall. Victor's already gotten back sight. Saucy was surrounded and disposed of as oh, Demon no. One continues his fragging ways. Yeah. And dug that gap in the A main wall. Ended up being the demise, but Zekin gets the spam kill on Ethan. Vic's pushing heaven. Vic's pushing heaven. Tags John. Applies pressure. Now they have to respond and they have to deal with him. Mark utility out with a classic in his face. Oh. Tries to tuck tail and get away. Somehow survives. <laughs> How much more time can he buy? What is this fight? Yeah. He falls. It's all onto Demon One. With He's a got classic. a classic, but they're weak. <laughs> 21 HP. They're champions, but this is a tough ask. It's a good flash. Victor dead. They've done such a good job of playing around these Viper walls. I know it's early, but you're already seeing the game plan. They're just not really there in spawn. No contact anywhere. And now they're going aggressive. Tens with a deep TP there into the corner, catching Victor off guard. That was all set up from a flash from Saucy. Now, what do you do as NRG? We know they're so good at mid rounding. They're great in these man down disadvantage, uh, disadvantages. Fault line setup. 
It's no value though. Flash around the corner. There's just so many things that they can use to get out onto the site to take aggressive space. But this smoke, they're just playing on the other side of it. That ball oh, is so good. Another gorgeous use of utility by tens. Spike it all falls down onto crashies sitting on the other side of a trip. There's no combo though. There's no one really to swing off of this with him because of the rest of the defenses have already pushed into garage. Zelsus taking the best of Demon 1. And he's got a tuck tail, he's got to get away. Keep a close eye on Zelsus so he continues to push the pace into main, into garage. What an awkward situation. <laughs> Shot has to be clean, flash in his face, tries to turn it and stay alive. Zek can now satcheling forward with ult and hand landing it onto Vic. The spam is just too much though. He's stuck. Careful here. You have to deal with him. You can't afford to just leave him there. Oh. Finally swinging out, getting to safety. Spike not committed. Spike not planted. Finally, an attempt will be successful. Spike planted. Wow. 2v2, oh Tens gets another. Crash, he's left alone. Can he pull it off? No. This should be a good read from an RG. They're not gonna clear him. The dog missed. They're not gonna clear Zelsis. Oh, this is the wrong. He hears him, he sees him. Again, disaster. And they've gotten out onto the site. Can they convert? John trying to hold them back. This 1v1 is everything. Two bullets left. <laughs> John QT decides to step away. Reposition. Crashies as old. Shadows traveling. Demon 1 can reposition. If they commit, the paranoia is there. No follow up yet as they're traded. And now. The Rolling Thunder comes through. Shadows. Waves crashing into the opposition. A little bit of buying of time as John QT plays his cards as perfectly as he can. The cam is still up. He's oh gonna find the timing! God. He gets them both! Three on the round for the leader! Ethan left alone. Can he pull off this 1v2? Attention divided, nine bullets left, 32 oh. HP, and he cannot! Any sort of momentum, any sort of success for NRG. Oh. He understands that Opera's like the reposition. Opera's like tens like the reposition fast. And that gets him this timing and event. He's so far up, but you see the respect that's being shown. Zekin's playing back in spawn. He knows that heaven may be a weak spot, a vulnerable area. Did that see him? It didn't. I can't believe that. Sassy pushing forward. Two members there, none found. Oh, this is this is gonna be so hard for Sentinels. Ten still is up, knife out, utility out. Oh my gosh. And finally, NRG seem to find some success. They seem to find some space. Tens is still alive here. And he still wants oh, five no. with the up. Trying to land the shots. Oh, no. Missing everything, going wide. He's out. And now John QT shows up and he plays back in. Spike planted. Tens <laughs> persistent in his approach. Relentless and reckless abandon. As he re-aggresses and re-peaks. Oh my gosh. Now with the shorty oh still. Oh my gosh, to stop planning for him. It's gonna be a 2v5. Can Demon 1 pull this off? Oh! Can he pull it off? An angel of deliverance! I mean, you can't teach that. Even the pre-fire on the Ethan from John. Oh. I mean. Oh! Okay. Turns out Demon 1 is still good. I mean, they they no doubt in my mind to anybody's mind we thought that energy was winning that round oh he played anti oh my gosh okay he was spotted <laughs> oh he again a little bit of room he found got him. he got him he got him good there now it was a 2v5 last time i know oh, no. the, the chances are ridiculous last player standing <laughs> but finally it seems like energy are gonna get on the board thrifty team at bay for now he just breaks it now, and now they're wrapping vents. Oh, that's bad. That's oh, trouble. I'm playing from safety. Seconds left. Now this pushing forward. Thing. Yeah, this is so. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, normally, for, for regular humans, that's a difficult angle to deal with. <laughs> but they just continue to push forward and demand the best out of each other. I have the spike. Ten seconds like iron left. sharpening iron. Oh. Both pushing each other to their very limits. They've got to get the spike down. There's no flood. They're so weak. No armor. Less than 50 HP on both. Celsus is dropping down. John close by. Spike ticking away. No way. Crash, he's falls. Demon one with the op. Two shots to hit. First one does it. 
another cam already up for John. So he has the aim. He has the B main line. 30 seconds. Fall line set up to help take ramps. Oh, this is perfect for Tyson. Is this another classic tens moment? The one falls. Oh, no. The second will not join him. Sopsy from back side oh. though gets all three. Spike down A. And again, another explosive moment. Left. He had no one. Great. Just not to the standard that everyone holds him to. Yeah. That he holds himself to, even. <laughs> like, second just stays. The disrespect is here. A complete dismantling from top to bottom. Sentinels have had their way with NRG this half. It's just hitting every shot, every timing, every spam. Oh, it's even one. Right. There's a chip here. Left. Hang on. We missed the clip. There's only five seconds. This yeah. is just too I'm, much to ask for. Yeah, I mean, he's not winning the round. Oh. Tens is holding mid, and Everyone's they have three members A. Oh, Second is ult. Oh. Does he hold? Oh my gosh, he doesn't tag anything. But he still has so much util, he can dump down. Victor playing in hell. Trying to find some space, trying to find some value. Duel is done. He continues to push forward, trampling towards elbow. John has spammed two people through this screen smoke. And the one on to Victor, potentially the most valuable, potentially the most impactful. Another spam. Demon one left alone. The potential last round of the half. And the potential of an 11 to one lead. 30 seconds left. Oh, he made a stop. He's been heard. Oh. He's been spotted. He's been found. And John, it just looks so good. Along with everybody else on the roster. And they were so ready for that. They, they four man swung him. And honestly, to go back to a little bit more recent, remember the beginning of this year, this wasn't the roster that they had. It was Pancato who was in the works. Yeah. For them to traverse all of that and now find themselves here. And Jordan, he, he earned his North American Valorant. I mean, this is gonna mean so much to them if they win this pistol. You know they're gonna be. 30 seconds left. Popping off on all cylinders. What? Marv has something to say about that. What? Oh my gosh. Does he go for more? Ah, He's taking a breath here. The amount of dropped jaws that I just saw in the crowd is ridiculous. I think everybody felt like it was gonna be in Sentinel's hands, but Marv has something other to say about it. Four headshots. He's done it on his own. Oh, he was ready to get, take the head off his teammate. Can he finish it? Oh! He's Wait given his second. opportunities. One shot? Oh, he's gonna rob him of it. Wait. We're just playing a mini game right now. Oh, oh, the ace and he does. We'll take a look at it again. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I've jokingly always said that the Ion Sheriff was like automatic headshots, but <laughs> I mean, that looked like truth there. Make sure you follow I by power on some. The contact back up mid, they're showing stuff towards B to try to bait a rotation out from NRG, and that kill should definitely bait it. Look left. at the players on A. Instantly rotating. Oh, Marv knows to stay. They got a paranoia. They ran into this. I don't think it hit crashes. He's got a fault line, jumps across. He's got a flash to work with too. Oh. The satchel out onto the side. <laughs> nice shots land though. 13 seconds left. The spike's still not planted. Marv's still not cleared. He's gonna challenge the orb. He's gonna challenge the spam. But John Spam covers him. Get down, Mr. President. How much more can they find though? No, Crashies left alone. Can he pull this off? He's gotten the first and then... The addition of John QT to this roster has been everything. The nade is good. Now potentially putting oh, the finishing oh. touches on this series. It's a one for one. Mark has a shorty from that distance, will not connect. Crash, he's dumping you till Vic so far away. And they freeze, they hold, they reset. They can taste it. I mean, the bags are half packed at this point. 30 seconds left. Oh, they're so patient. And look, that causes energy to worry about a lurk. Yeah, but this long? This now, nade. committing the nade there. He's just some coming to his death, coming to terms with the fact that he's done. A 3v2 number still in favor of Sentinels. 
And now quiet across the map as the spike ticks away. Ethan with a flash in hand, having to make a play in the flash. Not connecting as the wall goes up. Crash, he's got one. Ten's trying to keep him back. Saucy joining with him. Ooh. Looping around, having to reload. Where's the cover? There it is. Crashy Saucy, a 1v1. Oh, he's so confident. Four bullets left, switches weapons. Time is of the essence. What a moment. For Sentinels, what a moment for the league. Oh. Sentinels look so good. Bouncing back off of that last map. What a moment in time. Then our G. So close, but not yet there yet. More time.